More than a day after a landslide rolled over the Chilcotin River, 50 kilometers southwest of Williams Lake, officials say they're bracing for what will happen when the debris, which is about 600 meters wide and 30 meters deep, gives way. In the event of the dam collapsing, an outburst of water could flow down the Chilcotin River and into the Fraser River, bringing with it a significant amount of debris. The risk to people and communities along the river is unknown at this time, but it has the potential to be significant. The slide happened late Tuesday night, prompting evacuation orders for 60 properties, including 12 homes. The Caribou Regional District says it's too unsafe to clear the debris, which it estimates will collapse in the next 24 to 48 hours. And it will happen either one or two ways. Either the water that is building up behind the landslide will get to the level where it goes over the top of the landslide, or the water will find a way through, like a fissure through the um, landslide area. And as that water gets through that a small area, it will erode away the sand. So eventually um, the whole thing will give way. The Chicotan River upstream of the landslide is under a flood warning, while the river downstream of the landslide is under a flood watch. The Fraser River is also under a flood watch from Chicotan to Hope and under a high stream flow advisory from Hope to the ocean. If you were planning to boat on the Fraser this weekend, I am urging you to change your plans and avoid the Fraser particularly between Hope and the Chilcotin Confluence. Bowen Moss says if the debris collapses, it's estimated it would take 12 to 24 hours for the water to reach Hope. The province says engineers, geologists, hydrologists and other technical experts are on site assessing the situation. This is a dynamic and developing situation. I am urging all British Columbians that live or work near the Chilcotin River and the Fraser River between the Chilcotin Confluence and Hope to remain extremely vigilant. One person was injured when the slide happened. They're recovering in hospital, but their dog remains missing. Monica Gould, City News.